Hey everybody, this is Mr. MathBlog. This lesson is um, the three-digit edition. We're going to regroup some ones. So if we get a two-digit number in ones, like say we had 13 ones, so we're going to regroup those 13 ones as 110 and three ones. We'll explain that in just a minute. And um, don't forget, all of your math lessons all the way through high school are at www.mrmathblog.com. So when you get into third grade, you'll find your lessons, fourth grade, fifth grade, sixth grade. Now all the way up through high school and calculus and stuff, okay? All right, so here's our common course strand for our really cool teachers. And then our question is, is when do we group the ones in addition right here? Okay, so so we're going to use our, our, our blocks here. So here's our hundreds flat. Here's our tens strip and our one block right here. We're going to use these blocks to model the problem, and then we'll draw quick pictures to show what we did, okay? So we're first going to draw the, the block and then uh, use the blocks to, to do some addition here on three-digit numbers. And we'll draw a quick picture and do the exact same thing, okay? So there were 213 people at the show on Friday and 156 people at the show on Saturday. How many people were at the show on those two nights? Okay, so let's go ahead and represent the 213 first. So I'm going to do 200. I'm going to do two of these blocks right here for the 200, okay? Two of those uh, 100 uh, flat. So there's 100. This is Friday. There's 200 right there. Okay, and then how many tens do we have in 213? The tens is this middle number right here, so there's only one ten. So we're going to put one of these uh, flat sticks right here. This one stri strip, we'll put it right here. So here's one ten. And then three ones right there for 213. So there's our three ones. So we'll put three of these uh, one blocks right here. So here we go. One, two, three. Okay, there's Friday. Now let's do Saturday. Okay, Saturday is 156. So we're going to add one of these for the hundreds right here. So we'll grab a, a hundreds flat for a hundred right there. So here we go. Okay, and since we're using um, these blocks right here, I can't show you that five trick on this, although I probably could have. I just didn't right there. I'm just going to do um, uh, five of these ten uh, strips right here. So we'll just do that right, right down below. So here's one, two, three, four, five. Whoops, you saw one of those ones I forgot to uh, take out. Or did you? Maybe you didn't. Okay, so now that's um, uh, for the 150. Now let's do the six ones blocks right here. So I'll do six of these guys right here. And we always stack them in stacks of five. So there's one, two, three, four, five, and then there's six. We'll start another stack right there. Okay, so now we're going to combine them and put them together. So I'm going to go ahead and add them. So I'm going to put all these hundreds together, put all these tens together, and put all these ones together. So what I'll probably do is take um, uh, this guy and slide it down here. And then I'll probably, you know, and I'm just regrouping them. And then I'll take these guys and probably slide those like right down here. And then anyway, so, so how many do we have all together right there? Okay, we have... Uh, three of the hundreds blocks, so three, and it looks like we have five plus one is six, so 350, and then we have, um, uh, looks like nine of the ones, so 350, or 69, sorry, did I say 59? 69, there's six of those 10 strips right there. One, two, three, four, five, and then here's six. So six, 369, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and draw a quick picture right there. Let's go ahead and do it again for the 213. There's 100, 200, and for the 13, there's one, and then for the three ones, one, two, three. And then on Saturday, we had 156, so we only had one hundreds block, and we had five. There's one, two, three, four. Now remember, it's easier to see the fives if you just cross them off like that because it's uh, um, it's nice to count by fives, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. So when you start adding in groups of fives, it's easier to see them like that. Okay, so let's do the six ones for 156. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, remember we always stack them in stacks of five right here. So Here's a stack of five. So it's easier to count when you have them in stacks of five. It's easier to count when you have them listed like this in, in fives also when you're just drawing them. Okay. And if, um, uh, if I was giving an assessment or an assessment as a test in, in high school or a quiz, um, I would have my students drawing these pictures. These would be our hundreds. These would be the tens. And these would be the ones. And I'd want my students to draw those. Okay. All right. So together we have, uh, we have, 
300 right there. Okay, and see how easy it is to see those fives right there. There's five plus one is six, so 360, and then we have them in stacks of five. Five plus four is nine, so 369 right there, okay? So describe how we modeled the problem. Okay, so we showed the hundreds, tens, and ones for each number, and then we added them to find the total right there, okay? So here's the 200, and this is a one, three, so 213. Here's the 100, and this is 5, and this is 6, so 156. So when we add them together, there's 300. Here there's 6, 10, so 3, 6, and then there's 9 of these guys together, so it gave us uh, 369 right there. Okay, so let's go ahead and add. We're going to add now and regroup some numbers. So when we regroup is when we get a two-digit number. So we're going to add 200, uh, let me take that up there, we're going to add 246 to 117. So the first thing we do is we add the ones right here. So we're going to add, oh, um, well, let's model these also. So here we go. So there we go. I have, uh, here's my two one hundreds, here's my four tens, and here's my six ones right there. Okay, let's do the same thing. So we'll do one square for the one hundred, one stick for the one ten right there, and then seven ones. So we'll do five and then two over here. Okay, so there that is right there. Okay, so now the first thing we're going to do is add the one. So we're going to add six plus seven. Well, I know six plus six is 12, so six plus seven is going to be one more than that, so it's going to be 13. Okay, so let's go ahead and add those, and we get 13. Now we don't write a two digit number down here. What we do is we take the last digit, and that's how many ones we have, and this gets carried over in the next column, in the tens column. So we're going to replace. 13 as 110 and three ones right there. Okay, so here we go. So uh, we're going to regroup that, and so that's going to get us um, right here. Here's 13 right there, 110 and three ones. We never write a two digit number in the one spot or the 10 spot or the 100 spot. We always carry it over. So pretty soon we're going to start doing four digit numbers. And so, anyways, okay. So in our picture over here, uh, we have, um, what I did is, is we have, here's five, here's five, so five and five makes 10, that gives me 110 right there. So we added this 110 right there for these um, uh, uh, five and five ones right there. So these guys combine to make this guy right there. Okay, so now we can go ahead and add, here's four plus, uh, we're gonna over here, we got this one, we got these four and this one, so here it is, one, four, one. So now we're gonna add the tens column, so there we are, one plus four plus one equals six. Okay, and then, um, and notice um, what we did is, um, uh, these five and these five made this uh, tens stick right there, so they kind of go away. They're not there anymore. They're over here. They're combined into this guy right here. Okay, now we'll add the tens, okay? So this one stands for this one right here, okay? One ten. These four tens stands for these, these four right here, and then this one ten stands for that. So when we add those, we get six. That's not a two-digit number, so we don't have to carry. That's in our next lesson, by the way, when we start regrouping the tens. But here we're just regrouping the ones, so we're just going to add a number on top whenever we get a two-digit number in the ones right here. Okay? Anyway, sorry, I'm making that too long. Now we're going to go ahead and add 2 plus 1. So here, I'm going to go ahead and add 2 plus 1. Let me slide that up a little bit right there, okay? So 2 plus 1, let's go ahead and add 2 plus 1. 200 plus 100 is going to get us 300. Okay, so we get 363. Let me shrink it up and so we can see that. 363 right there, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and write the sum, okay? So notice there's a, a space above the 10 spot because we're going to regroup these ones. We're going to add 8 plus 4. 8 plus 4 is 12. So we're not going to write 12 down there. We're going to regroup the 12 as 110 and 2 ones. So 8 plus 4 is 12. Okay, or, I'm sorry, did I say, yeah, or 100 and two ones. Oops, I have this wrong. This should be 110 and two ones. Sorry, let me switch that. 110 and two ones. Let me do this. Sorry. I take these lessons and I, I trade them to other teachers, so... Um, so I want to make sure it's right when I go through, okay? All right, so here we go. So now we're going to go ahead and, and so here's our 12 right here. Here's our 1, 2 for 12. So there's 1, 10, and 2, 1s. That's what the 12 stands for, okay? All right, so now we're going to go ahead and add 
the tens now. So 1 plus 2 plus 3. That's what we're going to do now. So here we go. 1 plus 2 plus 3 uh, is going to get us. Whoops, I forgot to. Uh-oh, sorry. Let's see my... Let me go back here. I want this one. Sorry about that, you guys. So anyways, I make mistakes all the time. Does your teacher do that? I do it all the time. My kids love to correct me on them. I make them every day, by the way. Okay, so here we go. So 1 plus 2 plus uh, 3 is going to be 6. So how many how many um, uh, tens do we have? We have 6 tens, okay? So now uh, and there, there's no two-digit number, so we can go right to the hundreds. So we're going to add 3 plus 1. 3 plus 1 gets us 400. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. I'm having a hard time with this lesson here. I'm sorry, you guys. So anyways here we go so we get uh, the four ones right there okay all right uh, and then here um, uh, let's do this again so um, sometimes you don't have any carries you guys and that's okay so five plus three let's add the ones five plus three is gonna get us eight okay and it's not 18 it's just eight if it was 18 I'd put for 110 and eight ones but it's just eight so when we don't have a two-digit number, then we can just go to the next column. So now we're going to add these 4 plus 2 right there. 4 plus 2 is 6, okay? And then now we can just do 4 plus, there's nothing right there. So 4 plus 0 is 0. Or I'm sorry, 4. And so we get uh, 468. Boy, I hope my next lesson is a little bit smoother than this one. All right, you guys, I hope you're having fun in math and, and take care because math is fun.